Lens implants exist because of this man. After graduating from Cambridge University in 1927, Sir Harold Ridley decided he wanted to specialize in ophthalmology. He went on to receive his medical training at St. Thomas Hospital in London. During World War II, Ridley treated injured pilots who had shattered cockpit fragments in their eyes. To his surprise, this didn't appear to irritate the eyes. This sparked an idea and Harold began to theorize on how he could create an implantable lens out of the same material. Although successful, Sir Ridley and his treatment were met with harsh criticism. Many referring to Ridley's invention as a time bomb. In 1949, Sir Ridley performed the first ever cataract extraction with an intraocular lens implantation or IOL. Despite the backlash, Sir Ridley persisted, and as the success of this device became assured, the opposition to it began to wane. In the 1970s, Ridley finally began to receive recognition for his genius. He was praised by his peers and went on to receive knighthood, academic honors, and much more. Cataract surgery with IOLs is one of the most common and successful operations in medicine. Thanks to Sir Harold Ridley, millions around the world can see clearly again.